now let us discuss about full subtractive it is mainly useful in order to perform subtraction operation on three bits now let us see the block diagram of the full subtractor full subtractor accepts three inputs such as abc and it produces two outputs such as difference and borrow difference is denoted by d borrow is denoted by b now let us see the truth table for the full subtractor so here abc are the inputs whereas the outputs are d and b difference and borrow if there are three inputs then totally we will get 2 power 3 eight combinations like this uh, so now we have to perform what subtraction operation so first to subtract b from a and then subtract c from b okay 0 minus 0 means 0 only difference is 0 borrow is 0 again uh, so we have to subtract the 0 the c b 0 from the difference okay 0 minus 0 means 0 only 0 minus 0 means 0 only so difference is 0 borrow is 0 here 0 minus 0 means difference is 0 borrow is 1, 0 whereas 0 minus 1 means difference is 1 borrow is 1 next 0 minus 1 means what is 0 minus 1 difference is 1 borrow is 1 so borrow is 1 so we have to write 1 in the borrow whereas what is 0 minus 1 difference is 1 so now we have to subtract 0 from the 1 so 1 minus 0 means 1 okay next 0 minus 1 means difference is 1 borrow is 1 so we have to write 1 in the borrow whereas what is 0 minus 1 difference is 1 so now we need to subtract the c bit 1 from the difference 1 so 1 minus 1 means 0 next 1 minus 0 means 1 1 minus 0 means 1 so difference is 1 whereas borrow is 0 next 1 minus 0 means 1 1 minus 1 means 0 so 0 0 1 minus 0 means 1 1 minus 1 means 0 next 1 minus 1 means 0 0 minus 0 means 0 next 1 minus 1 means 0 whereas 0 minus 1 means difference is 1 borrow is 1 so now we have to uh, uh, construct now we have to evaluate the expressions for the difference and the borrow so d is equal to let us observe difference column so here we have four ones okay so what is the first one combination 0 0 1 so this can be written as a bar b bar c 0 0 1 next combination 1 0 1 0 so 0 1 0 means a bar b c bar so 0 1 0 a bar b c bar so next one next one 1 0 0 so 1 0 0 means a b bar c bar whereas what is the last one a b c a b c so if we observe the first two terms a bar is common a bar is common okay if we observe the first two terms so remaining terms are b bar c plus here b c bar next if we observe the last two terms so what is common a is common a is common so remaining b bar c bar plus b c next is equal to a into so this is nothing but uh, a exclusive or b we know the formula for a exclusive or b a bar b plus a b bar a bar b plus a b bar here what is the last combination last combination is all ones all ones okay all ones so difference is one borrow is one so last combination is all ones so difference is one whereas borrow is one okay okay next so this is nothing but uh, a exclusive or b formula here the terms are b and c so this is nothing but b exclusive or c formula plus a into so this is nothing but exclusive nor formula exclusive nor formula we know that exclusive nor is nothing but the complement of xr the complement of xr so this is nothing but the formula for x nor gate x nor gate means xr complement so we can write this as b exclusive or c complement bar okay next if we observe here if we observe here let us assume that this term is b now it will become b bar okay so this is in the form of i'm sorry here what is the term a bar here a bar is the term so this is in the form of a bar b plus a b bar 
so this is nothing but de morgan this is nothing but exclusive r formula exclusive r formula a exclusive r b so a exclusive r what is b here what is b here b exclusive r c so here that difference formula is difference is equal to a exclusive r b exclusive r c so now we have to evaluate the formula the expression for the borrow so b is equal to b is equal to here we have uh, four here in this column we have four ones okay so let us write those terms so for the first one what is the combination a bar b bar c for the first one zero zero one a bar b bar c for the second one the combination is a bar b c bar a bar b c bar for the third one the combination is a bar b c a bar b c for the last word the combination is a b c a b c here if we observe if we observe the first two first one and fourth one first two term and fourth term what is the common c is the common if we observe the first two term and the fourth term then c is the common so here we will get a bar b bar here ab next if we observe the second and third term which is common a bar is common as well as b is common so then we will get c bar plus c okay so c into this is nothing but a bar b bar plus ab this is nothing but x nor formula we know that x nor is nothing but the complement of xr the complement of x nor is nothing but the complement of exclusive r okay so we can write this as a exclusive r b bar okay plus a bar b we know that c plus e bar is nothing but 1 1 into a bar b is nothing but 1 only 1 into a bar b is nothing but a bar b only so this is the expression for the borrow so what is the expression for the borrow borrow equal to c into a exclusive r b whole bar plus plus a bar b a bar b a bar b okay so now we have to draw the circuit for the difference and the borrow here what are the input variables a b c are the input variables if we observe here in half subtractor the formula for the difference is a exclusive or b whereas here the formula for the difference is a exclusive or b exclusive or c whereas the formula for the borrow in half subtractor is a bar b whereas in full subtractor the formula is a bar b plus c into a exclusive or b whole bar so this is the formula okay so here we require three inputs so the first input is a uh, next uh, let us have a not also so for that purpose we have to perform the complement so next to term is uh, next input is b we need to have b uh, b not also not of b also next to term is uh, next input is c we need to have not of c also not of c also yeah next what is the formula for the difference a exclusive or b exclusive or c we know that exclusive or gate will accept only two inputs it it can't accept three inputs so first we need to perform exclusive or operation on a and b and then we need to perform exclusive or operation on a exclusive a a exclusive or b as well as c so first let us uh, perform exclusive or operation on a and b so this is nothing but a this is nothing but b so let us perform the exclusive or operation so it will produces a exclusive or b as the output now we have to supply a exclusive or b as well as c as the input to the one more exclusive or gate okay so this is nothing but c so let us supply these two as inputs to the another exclusive or gate okay another exclusive or gate so this is a exclusive or b and this is nothing but c so it will produces difference what is the formula for the difference a exclusive or b exclusive or c next we have to evaluate borrow we have to draw for borrow what is the formula here c into a exclusive or b complement already we have a exclusive or b now we need the complement of a exclusive or b so for that purpose simply we need to perform the not operation so it will produces a exclusive or b complement so we have to multiply with c so let us multiply with c so this is c let us multiply with c and operation 
So it will gives, it will gives, the sand gate will gives C into A exclusive R B bar. C into A exclusive R B. Okay. Next, we need to perform A B bar also. A B bar also. So here we have A. Here we have A. Already we have A here. Next, we need to have B bar. So this is A. So this is A, A symbol. Next, we need to have B bar. So B bar means this not symbol. So the signal will gives B bar. So we have to perform the multiplication. So it will gives A B bar. So this is uh, this is what this is A. The symbol is A, whereas the symbol is B bar. So next we have to supply these two as inputs to the R gate. R gate plus means R gate. So it will gives the borrow. What is the formula for borrow? A B bar plus C into A exclusive bar B whole bar. Okay. So this is about uh, full subtractor.